Welcome back guys to another video and today we're going to show you how to export your CSV file from your ledger. Later on you can import that CSV into your portfolio tracking software like coin tracking and later on generate your tax report. All we need for that is our ledger device, the ledger software and coin tracking and the USB-C cable. In our case we are using the Ledger Nano X but you also can use the Nano Ledger S Plus and so on. So first thing first we have to unlock our device so we insert our pin and the application is ready to use. Now we simply connect the Ledger to our software and to our computer and you will hear it clicking once it's in. We have to enter our pin one more time. Once we unlocked our device with the pin, then our Ledger Live app will be also unlocked. And we can see here our portfolio. And then if we go down to accounts, then we see all our accounts here. We only have Ethereum, but you will have probably a bunch. All you have to do is go here into the settings and then to accounts and then operational history. Then click on save and then we can select all the accounts you have in your wallet. For best practice, it would be to export all your accounts. So please select all the accounts and then save. Once you've done that, then simply save the file and you will have the complete Ledger Live history in your download box. Now we have to go back into coin tracking, for example, and then go to enter coins, wallet imports and go to Ledger Live. One more time here, you will have the complete step-by-step -step tutorial how to get your um, CSV file or the CSV export in Ledger Live. But if you follow this video along, then you know that too. And then you simply can choose the file and upload it. And then you will have all the transactions in coin tracking. Once all your data is consolidated, and then you will be ready to go to the um, tax report section and generate your tax report up here. To generate our tax report, we simply go to tax report and click tax report. Now we are in the crypto tax report site where we can generate our tax report. But before we have to set up the tax report with some options and settings. So for the country, we select our country, in our case it's Germany, but there's a variety you can choose from. Then for the tax method, we use first in first out, but again, there are a lot of tax options you can choose from and depending on your situation, choose the right taxation method. Then for the tax year, we use 23 as our tax year, but again, depending on your trading behavior, there will be many different years uh, to choose from and depending on your need to generate the tax year you need. Then for the filters, you can include and exclude specific transaction types if you want to. Then previous trades, consider all previous trades in the report. This is an option you should leave on. Then you can use the deposit separation tax slots if you want to or not. And you can group all purchases by day and group all search by day. If you have a lot of transactions in your account, this will speed up the generation process of the tax report. Once all done and you have your settings in, we can generate a new tax report. Once you have generated new tax report, you will see in the bottom the total capital gains and the year of the taxation, the taxation method. And if you want to see more information about your tax report, simply click load report. This is a much more detailed view of the report. And once it's loaded up, we will see all the details about the report. The details have loaded and now we can see how much capital gains we had, how much income we had. And if you scroll down, you will see even more details line by line, transaction by transaction, what you exactly did, how much you profited off it or lost on it. We see the income, we see the gift donations, the fee report, the loss on stolen, the closing positions. We have everything in this report. And if you need to submit your report, then simply scroll up and go to download in this report and then simply click download PDF or download Excel and then you can submit it or give it to your CPA and move from there on. We hope this video was helpful to you and if there are any open questions, please leave them down in the comments and we will happily answer all the comments for you. We wish you happy trading and we'll see you soon. Bye bye.